need to know before heading to the polls. He begins our campaign 2016 coverage at 11. Well, good evening, Stan and Erica. The people who have voted before usually know what to expect when they vote on Election Day, voting early in the morning or after work, along with some long lines. But sometimes you're in a rush, you forget something. So today, I spoke with election officials to find out exactly what you need to know before you vote. Local election boards are fully staffed and ready for tomorrow. A line out the door in Trumbull County as people cast their vote on the last day of early voting. It gets increasingly tense the closer it gets to Election Day. Polls will open tomorrow at 6.30 in the morning and close at 7.30 in the evening. Stephanie Penrose is the director of Trumbull County Board of Elections. She says the most common issue people face? Usually go to the wrong polling location. If you do go to the wrong place, poll workers can help you find the correct location. Also remember to bring your ID with you. If you don't have one, Penrose says a utility bill or bank statement will also be accepted. And if someone is harassing you at the polls, report it to the volunteers working at the location. Most of the time, once you talk to them politely, they understand and they they tone it down. But we have had to send the sheriff before. Under Ohio law, campaigners must be 100 feet from the entrance of a voting location. Election observers will be allowed, but they can't take pictures or video. As for taking a selfie with your ballot, Ohio has a long-standing law against voters letting their ballots be seen to let people know how they voted. But the law remains unclear about legality. State Election Chief John Husted said local election boards will talk to their attorneys about how to apply the law. Penrose says it's always best to err on the side of caution. Now, if you need a ride to the polls tomorrow, both the Democratic and Republican parties will give you a ride. We have the numbers for those parties in Mahoning, Trumbull, and Columbiana counties on our website, WKBN.com. You can find all of those there. For now, in the studio, Dan Marcel, WKBN 27, First News at 11.